In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a simple yet effective membership site. For example, I have here e-course menu with a basic training posts and the other one for trainees. That means I have two different access groups. One can access to the courses and the other one only for the materials for trainees. I'm going to also show you how to integrate it with a WooCommerce that is you can purchase uh, memberships. For example, if you purchase a VIP membership, then after logging in, you'll see this menu up here and you can access your course. Otherwise, if you would like to access this URL, then you'll see that this content is restricted message appears here. It's fairly easy to set up. So if you're interested, then jump in. Now, first things first, the plugin we're going to use today is called Sure Members, the one you see on the screen right now. It is suitable for agencies, bloggers, podcasters, course creators, e-commerce gurus and influencers. And it has a bunch of good built-in features. For example, uh, trip content is something you may like, especially if you're selling courses or if you would like to give access to some content, for example, today and some content later, you can schedule it as you, as you like. Also, you can add access rules and protect your content based on these rules. What is also a nifty feature is a paywall. That means you can protect your content and sell the access to the content. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to do that. Next, you can create user roles and they work well with page builders like Elementor and Breezy and so on. You can display or hide menus based on the access groups and you can bulk edit users. Next nice feature is that it's deeply integrated with Sure Triggers. If you don't know what Sure Trigger is, it's an automation tool which allows you to connect your site with hundreds of applications like MailChimp and ActiveCampaign, which also allows you to create sales and marketing funnels or just simply add the data to Google Sheets. In this video, I'm not going to go over the Sure Triggers, but I'm just letting you know that Sure members can easily be integrated with Sure Triggers. And a couple of words about the team behind the Sure members. It's the same team that is behind the Astra, the most popular team of all time with more than 1 million active installations. So they are experienced developers with a cool team behind it. At the time of creating this video, they have a special offer that is you can save up to 50% on all membership plans. And at the moment, the prices are the one you see on the screen right now. I'm going to put the link to the Sure members to the description of this video. So if you're interested, then just follow the link. Now, in order to keep it short, let's log in and let's set it up. So after installing the Sure members, you'll see this menu on the left. Click on it. And the first thing you'll see are the access groups. I have two. One is for e-course and the other one is for trainee groups. Up here, there is also a settings panel. If you click on it, you'll see the admin settings whether to display the Sure Member icon and block editor, what does it mean? It's the one you see up here. This icon displays you whether the post or page are under the restrictions or not. If I click on it, you'll see that there is an e-course access here. That means only e-course access group can access this post here. If I click here, I can see all the access groups or I can create a new access group. So you can enable or disable it here. Whether to restrict the content in re search results, hide book coupon field. Next one, user roles to decline the admin access. I'm going to decline for trainees and e-course members. I can assign access groups to new registrations. For example, if someone registers on my site, then he or she will automatically be added to the trainee group. Here I can create a custom user roles. For example, test group. Next one, redirection rules, login styler. What will it do for you is that you can customize your WP admin login page, add the logo, change the colors, add the background image and so on. This all can be done here. Here are some login restrictions and text labels you can change. And this was the admin panel. Now let's see how does this work here. I'm going to go to the posts and categories and I'm going to add a category called e-commerce. This is the one I'm going to add to the access group later. Now I'm going to go to the appearance and menus. I'm going to add this category to the menu 
And what is a nice thing here, I can grant access to the specific groups for this menu only. For example, here show the menu when user is in or is not in a specific access group, for example, trainee group, the one I created earlier. Let's save it. Let's drag it up here and save it. Now I'm not logged in to the site and you'll see that I don't see this one here. If I log in and I'm added to the trainee group, then you'll see I can see this menu up here. But if I add a post to this category, let's add it to the e-commerce category, publish, I'm going to grab the URL, log out and access the URL once again, then you'll see Then I can access because I haven't restricted the access here. So how can I restrict the access? Let's go back to the Sure members. Let's add new, create a access group called e-commerce group. And now I can select what type of content I would like to protect only for this group here. So I'm going to select specific pages, posts, and taxonomies. And I'm going to search for e-commerce. That means I'm going to grant access to the old single post from e-commerce group. Next, I'm going to choose action for unauthorized access. That is whether I'm going to redirect them or I'm going to display the message. I'm going to display the message. Message is access is granted only for members. Please contact administrator. Button text, contact now. Button URL, I'm going to redirect them to the contact page with it. And also I'm going to enable login button. Now, if I save the settings and refresh this page here, you'll see I just protected this one here. But there is also one other issue here. That is, if I access the category page using URL, I can access it, but I can't access the single post. What if I would like to deny also this address here? Well, it's also easy to do. That is, I'm going to add here an option to URL matching. And I'm going to restrict this URL here. Save, refresh, and done. Easy, isn't it? OK, what else you can do here? You can drip content. Just click here, search for content, for example, all singulars from WooCommerce basic training. Or first, I'm going to display this post. And after two days, at zero, zero at night, I'm going to add another one, this post here. And this way you can drip your content and you can easily create some kind of e-course for yourself. Now I'm going to delete those here, save it and display that you can also add the downloads to the group. Maybe there are a bunch of files you would like to protect. Then just add the download, drag it here, send the link. And only those who have the link can access it. Now, I would like to display how to create a access to the e-course. In order to keep it short, I'm going to display the settings for you. That is, I created a category WooCommerce basic training. I added three posts to it, WooCommerce payment methods, shipping methods, and WooCommerce setup. If I open it up, you'll see it's protected. I added this to the WooCommerce basic training category, but under the Sure members, I created a group called eCourse Access. In a similar way, I showed you before, I protected content for specific taxonomies, that is for all singulars for WooCommerce basic training, and for URL matching, this one here. I created a product, this one here, VIP membership. And what will this do? So if you purchase this product, you will be added to eCourse Access Group, which means you can access all posts from WooCommerce Basic Training. If you're not added to the Access Group, you can't access it. And there is a button that redirects you to the product page. Let's see how does it work. So I'm going to grab this URL here, go to this page. There is a button, Purchase Now. I'm going to be redirected to the VIP membership page. I'm going to purchase it. Then I'm going to log in. And now I can access the e-course and all the posts. What else did I do? This is a 
WooCommerce My Account page, but what did I do? I added the dashboard tab, my courses tab, and support tab. If you want to know how to create a custom WooCommerce My Account page, then I have a separate video about it. Take a look at the description of this video. At the moment, I'm going to just show you what did I do here. So, you can do it with every page builder or every block builder. For example, you can use a Spectra blocks for it. But I added a row layout here. Now I added a tabs block. In the first block, I added a WooCommerce My Account shortcode. Here I added a text block. And now what's good is that Sure Members allows you to restrict this block. I added a rule that display this text block only if the user is not in the eCourse access group. For example, if I open it up, I haven't purchased it, this text is displayed. Next, I added a posts block, and under the strict this block rule, I added that show this block only if user is in eCourse access group. I chose that display posts only from WooCommerce basic training taxonomy, and it's good to go. Last one is the simple support tab here. So, if you're a WooCommerce user, you purchased the course, go to the My Account page, and you can access it from here. Awesome, isn't it? Now, last thing I want to show you is how to handle users. If you go to the users page, I have a bunch of users here. Let's choose this one here. If I would like to add this user to the specific user group, then here's the option. Add access group. I'm going to search for trainee. This one here. Add access and done. If I would like to revoke the access, then just click here and it's done. Or once again, grant access. If you take a look at the all users, you'll see all the active access groups the user belongs to. I can add this one also to the multiple groups. Currently, this user can access to the e-course, but I can add this person also to the trainee group. Update, go to users, and you'll see that it's updated. So, as you saw, Sure Member is a plugin that is really easy to use. Just a couple of clicks, and you can restrict your site content. You can add trip content. You can integrate with the WooCommerce and sell the memberships. It works well with BuddyBoss, TutorLMS, Elementor, LearnDash, DV, Spectra, and so on. And if you're interested, then once again, take a look at the description of this video. There is a link to the Sure members. At the moment, they have a 50% off from all the plans. Now, before you go, wait. If you find this tutorial helpful, then press thumbs up, this one here. And take a look at this side of the screen. It contains two good videos. I think you may find them useful. Meanwhile, take care. Bye.